here doing uh, some chicken research. Uh, when uh, I was offered the opportunity to, rather than live in a hotel, um, to come and live with the chickens, I felt like it was an opportunity I just couldn't pass up. A lot of people feel like, oh, you're doing a comedy. There's no research involved. There's no, I don't know, you just jump out of bed and read the script and you're done. But uh, the best results are achieved through a pretty scientific approach. The sounds they're making aren't arbitrary. And so, like, that means something. You know what I mean, I think the mistake the classic mistake in playing this role is to just make a sound that's a silly sound. But the um, and I've read there was a couple books about um, make a silly sound and comedy ensues. But I I have never agreed with that. And um, so that's like there's some mild anxiety, but also they're talking about being hungry. There's something about. Birthday. I don't know if, it, if there's a birthday coming or whatever, but there's. Anyway, the, the trick is to just pay attention to what their dynamic is, hear the sound, then you, it just becomes pretty obvious that there's some communication happening. And so when I'm going to be doing the sounds, I'm going to apply the same philosophy. I don't make a chicken sound unless I'm saying something. Oh! <laughs>